Welcome back to Ring of Red. Um, getting briefing on the second training mission. Uh, you'll now be briefed on your mission. I've gone over both the evaluation reports, both your evaluation reports and your shooting training. They're providing some valuable information. Good. I have got. I need to learn how to talk. They provided some valuable information. Good work. I've got to hand it to you. I didn't expect to be beaten. Predictable outcome, I say. Type 3 will finally be joining you today for a demonstration. Type 3? I didn't see it at all during the testing. 3 is the top of the line model from Nuglin. I had a hand in its development, as a matter of fact. Final adjustments took longer than they expected, and it only received a go-ahead for performance evaluation today. Looks a little... fragile. Looks can be deceiving. 3's assault capabilities far outrank both 1 and 2's. Scary thought. Anyway, what about our mission? Of course. Carry on, Colonel. Yes, sir. Listen up, both of you. It's time you had a taste of real combat. Today, you and Type 3 will engage under each other under combat conditions. Actual combat? It's another mock-up. Just more intense. All units will be armed with training ammunition. Close combat is out of bounds in order to safeguard the vehicles. We'll be t piloting Type 3. Shinji Kirishima, one of Nebulon's own pilots. He's also a former Southern Japanese Forces man. Hmm. He should be here by now. What's taking them so long? Colonel 3 is already on the training field. What? Both of you, prepare to defoy. Don't get Kirishima... Don't let Kirishima warm up before you. Uh... Do this a little... Today, you two and the Type 3 will engage one another in a simulated conflict under actual combat conditions. Kirishima's Type 3 is already out on the training field. This may be a simulation, but... a I expect all of you to treat it as a real battle situation. Weisinger! Anything I can do for you, Colonel? Distance is a key strategic element on the field. Do you understand that? How close or how far the target is can make all the difference. Well, now that you mention it. Alright, listen up. The starting distance in a battle... In a battles. The translation of this game is, like, pretty good, considering it's, a, like, an early... PS, like an early niche title PS2 game, but there are occasionally some grammatical and spelling errors. But the, all in all, I'm very impressed with the translation of this game. I'm really glad it isn't. It doesn't have voice acting because the dub would be awful. Uh, distance in a battle affects the initial t target acquisition percentage and the amount of damage inflicted on the target. Opening the battle from your optimal range is the first step to victory, right? You taught me all this, and I remember it all. Colonel, stop treating me like a rookie, will ya? Alright, well then let me ask you. This way, Ziggur, what's your AFW's optimal range? Medium range. Are you satisfied, Colonel? Very good. Alright then. I expect good results. Don't disappoint me. Okay. And I made sure to check, and the last episode came out great. The audio wasn't all fucked up like my original recording so we're good the infamous type 3 Nibelin's secret weapon not everything I've heard about that machine has been good you worry too much I have it from headquarters that this model was developed specifically for use in Japan I sincerely hope that is the case what is it that you're afraid of nothing nothing important but it's about to start. In a second, we'll start the mock combat training. Load the practice ammunition according to instructions. We may be simulating real combat. Remember, remember this is strictly for training purposes. Close combat is therefore forbidden, forbidden as a safety precaution. Yeah, I know. Victory condition, annihilation of all enemies. Loss condition, destruction of Weizsäcker's AFW, or going over the day 2, 1900 time limit. Hey, are you Japanese? Hmm? What are you talking about? I'm going to ask you again. Are you Japanese? Half Japanese. I'm half German, half Japanese, and raised here in Japan. Is that Japanese to you? Don't make me laugh. Scum like you doesn't have what it takes to be Japanese. I'll prove it right here. Okay. This guy's a dick.
So, you want to play a little, huh? This machine is a beauty. I should have no problem. Um, you remember that little uh, thing about close combat, right? No, it's forbidden. You know? No? Alright. Rapid punch sure sounds like close combat to me. Okay. That's all you got? Now, under normal circumstances, when you receive a close combat attack, um, if you have a machine that's capable of close combat, which mine is, you would automatically counterattack, but it's training and he wasn't supposed to do that, so obviously I'm not going to punch him back. Ah, uh, damn it! A direct shot from this close. Are you out of your mind? Type 3, cease fire. You know that close combat is strictly forbidden. Type 3, respond. Kirishima, this is an order! We have a situation. They've just found the bodies of Shinji Kirishima and the AF Type 3 AFW technician. They've been murdered. What? Kirishima, what's going on out here? Who the heck is on Type 3 right now? This is Type 3. Do you copy? I'll be taking this ride back with me. Don't worry, it'll be used for the common good, and the realization of a superior ideal. Who the heck do you think you are? You're not going anywhere! Who am I? Well, let's just say I'm the ghost of ten years past. You can't leave a cutting-edge craft in some amateur's hands. We'll make good use of it. I can assure you that. Ten years past. You're a North- Damn it! Type 1 and 2, pursue Type 3 immediately. Don't let the Northerners get a hold of the vehicle. Oops, he caught me napping. It was point blank. No warning. Looks like you can still move. We're going after him, understood? Think I need to be told? Who is he, anyway? Colonel said Northerners. North Japan, you know? The North Japanese? Well, I don't care who he is. I'm gonna get him. Replace the training ammo with the real thing now. While we've got the time. Live rounds, huh? What, you scared? Put a lid on it, will ya? Wait, listen. You get hit by one of those, you die. Understand? I'm not an amateur. I don't get hit. I hope you know what you're doing. Hey, what? That bastard, he called me a... You say something? No. Come on, let's go. Last time I checked, you weren't in any shape to give the orders around here. Alright, well... You're not taking that with you, buddy. You expect to stop me with that? If you're gonna expect me to go easy on women, you're sorely mistaken. <sighs> this fucking guy. Kyle sucks and I hate him. Oh. <laughs> Uh, spoilers, his, his name is Kai Ho. He's hand of the NFW now. Anyone gets my way, is dead. I do really dig Type 3's, like, double-barreled, folding-arm gun business. It's neat, though. God, he loads faster than me, too. You're fast, I'll give you that. Yeah, that fucking killed my accuracy. Oh, shit. So dodge action is um, one of the maximum attacks. It basically... The next regular shot I shoot at him will always miss, depend no matter what accuracy I have. Even if I wait until 100% accuracy, he'll just step out of the way of it. So... Oh, 
And aim weapon is a maximum attack where he shoots my gun and tries to break it. And if he successfully breaks it, I can still shoot, but my accuracy is just garbage. As you can see, I'm not supposed to win this fight. Okay, he didn't break it. It would have started on fire if he if he did. Okay, back into medium. He's already loaded again. Jesus Christ. Fuck, he's doing aim weapon again. I'm not even gonna get a shot off. Still didn't break it, but... Well, I guess he's gonna use fucking dodge action again. Hey look, I actually hit him. Oh, load, 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 load! Shit. Damn, he's almost killed Ryoko. Jesus. 54, that's not good. Okay, well, that went terribly. Very, very terribly. Damn, he's fast. Wait up, will ya? Um, I'm just gonna run up and punch him. <laughs> I think that's probably the safest course of action. I've got you. Let's see how fast you can run after a direct hit with a cannon. <laughs> Save the posting for when you do some actual damage. You. Got a long way to go, kid. And not much time left. Yeah, so he's still gonna get to hit me back, but at least I'll get some guaranteed damage on him with this close combat attack. Get into close combat before he shoots me. Good. Also, you'll notice he was able to do rapid punch from short range, which is totally not allowed. He's just a fucking cheater, but. Did a lot of this. Battlefield is an honorable way to go. Our boy does move fast. He's not a novice, I can tell you that. Okay. Um... Roka's gonna die if she gets over there, if she engages him, so I'll have her- he won't attack me, he'll just keep running away, so I'm gonna have her go up and recover. That didn't heal shit, bastard, wait till I get you all. Um, yeah, basically, since this is a no-win scenario, I'm just gonna recover these guys so that they don't die. So I know what's coming. There we go. 
<clears throat> Captain Kaiho, you did it! Good to see you, pilot. The Albatross is ours, just as we have planned. So this is the Albatross. Amazing! The mission was a success. It's time to withdraw. Yes, sir. We'll hold them back to give you a window. Good luck. I'm in your hands. So I just gotta kill these two little guys. Light AFW. We've got the superior firepower, but... Captain, get the albatross back north. You have to make it. Okay. Um, so light FWs don't have arms, so they can't hit back in close combat, so I'm just gonna run up and fucking punch this guy. And then Ryoko hopefully won't take any damage. And I'll get some damage off on that. Oh, look at him running away. It's gotta stop to aim at me, though. Yep, there we go. Ah, shit, you dodged it. Yeah, they, they always have, like, a percentage chance of, like, dodging close combat attacks, which sucks, but, oh, well, at least I didn't take any damage. Get out of my way, it's not you I'm after. Alright, Weisinger is healed enough, so. some decent damage. Alright, he's getting ready to fire. I'll wait till like 75. 78 damage. That's what happens when you have such light armor. He doesn't even have a cannon, he has a machine gun. And he missed too, so perfect. That's gonna miss. Damn it. Too greedy. Oh, this is gonna hit. 24, that's nothing. Machine gun at medium range, not gonna not gonna cut it. Moving up on me. This is gonna be a good hit. Boom! 71! Knocked a big piece of his armor off, too. I do like how the how the mechs actually take aesthetic damage. Okay, four, three, two, one. Come on, please hit! Yeah! Woo! Killed him in one combat, that's good. Oh, her, actually. Not bad. Hey, leveled up. Cool, cool. 
Oh, sunset now. You may be at the top of the AFW food chain, but we can still slow you down. We're not going any. You're not going anywhere near the captain. Um, do I run up and try and punch this guy? Yeah, I think I do. Because even though he can only do like 20 damage per shot, well, I'm in short range, so it'll probably do more. So yeah, I should punch him. Sunset looks cool. Can't hide. God damn it. Just let her punch somebody! Jeez! Is that too much to ask? Oh. Okay, yeah, I don't want to go to the woods of the river, so I guess I'll just stay here and shoot at him. See if I can kill him off in one fight, just like the last guy. Oh, nice! I hit him in the weapon! It's gonna make him re it really hard for him to hit me. Oh, he actually hit me. And it did 17 damage. too high. It's okay. As long as I land the next two shots, I should be able to kill him. Four damage and at long range. I don't think I'll I don't think I'll be able to take him out. So we got 84 HP, yeah. Shit. Oh I'll, I'll take the rest of the time and make this as good a shot as I can. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Climbed into medium just for me. 75! Oh! So close. Because 9 HP. It's okay. Ryoko can shoot him once and he'll die. Oh, he's gonna run. Ooh, now he's up to 29. And now I can attack him at medium range. This guy's fucking dead. Also, it's nighttime, and nighttime reduces your accuracy significantly. Which sucks, but it's just a fact of life.
You can see my starting accuracy now is at 22%. Which is terrible. Oh, uh, healing fixed his weapon, too. I'm gonna... I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna hold this one to get a really good shot off. Sweet, he missed. Now I can take all the time in the world. Keep going until he runs up again. I shouldn't have made it into short. It's okay. All I have to do is 29 damage. Boom! You're dead. Damn, where the heck did he go? Any communications called him Kaiho. Who is he? Weisiger, return to base. We're calling off pursuit. Why? We can still catch him. We can't afford to lose another vehicle, you understand? God damn it! Players will be given 50 success experience. Ghost level's up to two. Nice. Well done, both of you. Here are the results from this exercise. We have a situation. Wait in your quarters until further notice. Dismissed. Yes, sir. Colonel, wait! Wait, didn't you hear what he said? We gotta go back to our quarters. Damn. How could this happen inside South Japanese territory? What use is the Border Security Force? I've never seen anyone handle a prototype like that. Ghost of ten years past. Crimson Phantom, no less. There's a ring of death to that name. Or, or could you say a ring of red? <laughs> uh, uh, anyway. Crimson Phantom. Of all the phantoms that could have reappeared. I have a bad feeling about this. Okay, history time! <sighs> the Type 3 prototype was seized by a man they call Kaiho. Yu Kaiho, aka the Crimson Phantom, was the best AFW pilot the South Japanese forces ever had. Kaiho served as the military consultant for the Soviet Army during the Vietnam War. Soon after his arrival in North Vietnam, he took part in the coup d'etat in Laos. He spent the next several years tearing through hundreds of American AFWs until the fall of the South Vietnamese government. Could you imagine if the Vietnam War was fought with giant robots? What did he witness in the jungle hell of that war? What effect did exposure to, have, to so much suffering have on him? What I didn't know at the time was that the return of the Crimson Phantom would thrust me into the battle of my life. Chapter 1. The Divided Two Regions. Alright. Our first real mission... Um, another good place to end it, but, as always, like if you did, subscribe if you want, and I'll see you next time on a real battlefield! <laughs>